Hello and welcome students. Today I will be teaching you about excretion in humans. Excretion means whatever waste is generated in the body of any living organism that has to be thrown out of the body. The reason is if these unwanted things or undigested things that are present in the body if they remain they will become toxic for us and any human being or any animal if they keep on accumulating the waste it will be harmful for them now here we are going to study about humans as you can see i have drawn an outline of the excretory organs of humans in case of humans we have a pair of kidneys which is situated just below the lower abdomen and we see one left and one right kidney from each kidney you can see there is a tube called the ureter which passes it's a pipe and then they come to a bag like structure where they accumulate all the waste which is called the urinary bladder at the same time whatever is there in the urinary bladder it is thrown out of the body by the urethra the organ urethra now this is the basic let us understand the whole thing kidneys are very small structures they are not big they are very small but they are important as well because when we see the inside of the kidney we see that there is a cup shaped structure this cup shaped structure is one unit of kidney what we call as the nephron that means many the whole thing is the nephron this cup shaped structure is called the bowman's capsule it is known by the name bowman's capsule so whatever waste is generated in the body it comes from the arteries the and it accumulates or it gets collected in the bowman's capsule this way there are many such cup shaped structures but when we look at them they all look as if they are in an entangled way you cannot make out that they are so clearly visible they have to be observed under high power so whatever waste is generated the waste generated in our body are said to be nitrogenous waste you might have heard people having a lot of uric acid in their blood what is that uric acid it is the amount of nitrogenous waste which is present in the body and it is not being able to remove so whatever nitrogenous waste is accumulated in the body that is brought into the kidneys they get accumulated in these cup shaped structure the bowman's capsule and the unit of filtration or the unit of kidney is said to be the nephron when all these fill up after filling up they pass through this pipe called the ureter and drop by drop the waste which is in the liquid form because it has got water in them gets accumulated in the urinary bladder this way it comes from both the kidneys and a time comes when drop by drop the water or what we call as the urine gets full or the bladder becomes full with urine when the bladder becomes full with urine it exerts a pressure when it exerts a pressure there is an urge to empty the bladder and that is when you go to the toilets and whatever urine is there in the urinary bladder that is thrown out from the body to the uh, through the urethra and we get rid of all the waste in the body that is why the more amount of water you drink more amount of cleaning takes place in your body and the more water 
more is the cleaning less water there is a chance that these nitrogenous waste will accumulate in the kidney and lead to the formation of kidney stones so drinking water is always good this is how the functioning of the kidneys or the excretory system in humans take place but if we hear about plants it's a very different issue in plants they do not have this whole system they don't have kidneys they don't have any such organs for excretion so basically what do the plants excrete even they need to excrete the reason behind it is even they are living organisms they cannot accumulate waste in them so they have to excrete the first excretion is that of oxygen which they give out this they give out at the time of photosynthesis when photosynthesis takes place carbon dioxide is taken in and oxygen is given out but this oxygen is again reused by the plants during the process of respiration the same oxygen is used by the plants during respiration only during the night when photosynthesis stops and oxygen is not given out by the plants they take this oxygen from the atmosphere and utilize it for respiration then second is they give out carbon dioxide at the time of respiration same way if it is during the day time this carbon dioxide is again used by them for photosynthesis but if it is during night time they are discharged into the atmosphere that is one of the reasons why you might have heard elder people or elderly people in your houses telling you not to pick up any flowers or any leaves or don't go under the trees at night don't sit under the trees at night that there is no other reason it is the reason because there is more amount of carbon dioxide but during the day time it is rich in oxygen and third is sometimes there is yellowing of leaves yellow leaves this very commonly you might have seen that plants growing in our gardens or in an airy area wherever you see you will see some of the leaves turn yellow the whole plant is green but some of the leaves turn yellow yellowing of leaves means the leaves have accumulated lot amount of waste in them and the leaf is drying before the death the leaf becomes yellow what we call as senescence of leaves and fourth is they secrete certain substances what do they secrete you have heard about rubber plant from which rubber oozes out from the stem i'll give you another small example many of you while playing or uh, just moving around you pluck flowers and when you pluck flowers you see some sticky substance comes out that sticky substance what we call as the cell sap is nothing but the waste of the plant which is secreted from the stem or the branches of the leaves so there is a vast difference between humans and plants or animals and plants the reason is animals have a proper excretory organ whereas plants do not have an excretory organ whether they have or whether they do not have in both cases the waste has to be thrown out so the way is different but excretion has to take place because if there is no excretion the body will become toxic If you like my video do comment like share and subscribe my channel